Hi, I'm Mike with Sunlight Supply and today I'm going to demonstrate how you would set up a CO2 tank and regulator system for CO2 enrichment in your indoor garden. This is a 20 pound CO2 tank and a Titan Controls CO2 regulator. The CO2 regulator comes with plastic washers, 12 feet of dispensing tubing and instructions that include flow meter settings and a timing chart. The CO2 regulator is the device that uses this precision pinwheel knob to control the flow of the CO2 from the tank to the output tubing and ultimately enriching your garden. Now attach the regulator to the tank by installing the plastic washer and then securely fastening the brass output to the threaded connector located on the tank. Now we're going to head over to the tent to get it set up for a demonstration. Here we're going to attach the simple CO2 to the bottom of the reflector. Plug the CO2 regulator into either a 24 hour timer like the Titan Apollo 8 or into a CO2 monitor controller like the Hyperion one here. Once your CO2 controller or 24 hour timer is set correctly, you are ready to enrich your garden with CO2. Make sure that the regulator's face is pointing outward to be easily read and monitored. For flowering gardens, I recommend CO2 settings between 1200 ppm and 1500 ppm during daylight periods only. CO2 has been scientifically proven to improve growth and produce higher yields. Now for larger rooms, your regulator flow may be very high. In this case, we would recommend using an inline CO2 heater. This innovative device can help you to avoid headache and heartache when it comes to protecting your CO2 regulator. By installing the CO2 heater between the CO2 tank and the regulator, you can prevent cracking of the regulator's internal diaphragm and possible regulator freeze up that occurs with high CO2 flow conditions. Request Titan Controls CO2 regulators, inline heaters, and controllers at your favorite indoor garden retailer. And don't forget to subscribe to Sunlight Supplies YouTube channel for the latest in indoor grow equipment videos.